Yo, 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 welcome to the show, everybody. It's me, Ben, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, you guys have tended to enjoy when I do reactions to things other than music videos. So, today, we're doing that. Because I've seen pretty, yeah, at this point, I think I have seen every Blackpink music video. Um, I figured what we would do is maybe wheel our way back to a dance practice that I have not actually seen yet. Uh, this is a very popular one, the Whistle Dance Practice, uh, as I've just seen, has almost 100 million views, I think. I'm pretty sure that's what it's at, just about. Um, but for whatever reason, uh, it, it, slipped, it slipped by me. I never managed to see it. Uh, for those that don't know, Blackpink is the only group I've been able to see live, and holy crap, they were phenomenal. Um, I said this at the beginning of the last time I reacted to a Blackpink related video, so some of y'all are gonna be like, you told us this last time, shut up. Um, but you know, I like to make sure that people understand. Um, so yeah, big fan of Blackpink. Excited to watch this video, but before we get into this one, be sure to go check out my Patreon. There's a ton of really cool stuff over there for a very cheap price. Massive thanks to all of you that have already gone over there and pledged your support. Uh, there will definitely be some pl uh, plenty of Blackpink content over there from me eventually, like the next time they drop an album, which will hopefully be soon. Um, not gonna make any jokes there. Um, we'll definitely be uh, reacting to that over on Patreon, so be on the lookout for that. Album reviews are possible on YouTube, but they're still very dangerous, so I tend to just do my album reviews over there. Um, but yeah, let's get into this one, my friends. Let's have some fun, and uh, yeah, expect lots of pauses because I'm gonna be screaming about all four for the entire video. So if you have a problem with that, you shouldn't have clicked on the video in the first place. Let's go. All right, blow me away. Blow me away. Oh my goodness. Here's the thing, guys. Seeing this live was phenomenal. <laughs> Seeing this live was phenomenal. So I feel like being able to watch this back now, it'll be extra interesting. Actually, if I remember correctly, during the concert, they didn't do the entire choreo. So this is actually gonna be super interesting for me to watch because for the second half of the song, if I remember correctly, for the second half of the song, they more so, more or less, just uh, ended up sort of interacting with the fans, sort of like running up and down the aisle, um, and just like, you know, dancing around, not doing the choreo is the point. Every time I show up, no this is a, this is a struggle for me, dude. This is always a struggle for me. Every time I watch anything Blackpink, I have to remind myself to look at all of them and not just Jisoo. Oh my gosh, dude. Every time, again, every time I watch Blackpink dance, I'm scared that Lisa is going to pop every bone out of her body because she's insane. I wonder, and this is actually interesting that I'm choosing to react to this when I am, because I'm not, I'm not completely up to date on why um, exactly, uh, what was it? What was the hashtag about Rosé? Someone tell me in the comments. Um, but I, I avoided it simply because I wasn't sure exactly what was going on. Um, so if you guys want to explain to me what was going on there, that would help me out. Thank you. I just realized, bro, Jisoo's got the fresh kicks. Holy crap. Those look so sick. I wasn't even paying attention. Oh. So, fun fact. I feel like most Blackpink fans, I feel like for a lot of people, Whistle was your introduction. You know what I mean? And for whatever reason, it... I guess it slipped by me as one of the first songs I heard, uh, whatever. Woo! Yes! Put, we need, we need Jisoo in the front more often, please. Thank you, would appreciate. The other thing that I didn't say is that I think, I think the first time I heard Whistle, I was like, all right, this is good. And then the more, obviously, because I added it to my playlist, the more that I listen to it, the more it becomes one of my favorite Blackpink songs. So much energy right here. Yes! The kicks. The kicks are my favorite part. Let's go back. Yes! So if I remember correctly, around this part, I think, was when they stopped doing choreo live and sort of started to go and just mess around with the fans. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Almost, my only complaint about this video is I wish it was slightly better lit so that we can see whoever's in the back a little bit better. But whatever, it, it's all good. It's all good. I'll live. 
So yeah, all this is new choreo for me, y'all. Just for the record. Woo! Oh my gosh. I have, y'all, I have a severe Jisoo addiction, okay? I feel like mo the majority of the reactors that I like to watch that have a bias in Blackpink, it's always Lisa. Lisa is wonderful. I love her. But Jisoo? Jisoo? As Desi March says, Miss, Miss Korea? Woo! Ugh. I still have yet, I feel like Whistle is the one song that I don't actually have a favorite part of. Because I just like the whole song. Like, I think my favorite Blackpink song is Kick It. It's gotta be Kick It, because after seeing it live, it just became my favorite. But even in that song, I have a favorite part. Can I kick it? And everyone in the crowd goes, yeah, like it's, that's my favorite part. Whereas with Whistle, it's like, I can't pick. Like, is it Lisa's rap? Is it one of Jisoo's solo lines? I don't know. All of it's great. Uh. <laughs> that smile from Jenny right there is super cute. <laughs> Uh, like I said, man, I think choreographically my favorite part is the kicks because it's Objectively, it's it's really not that complicated of a move But that's also because the chorus itself is not that complicated of a chorus, right? It's not like one of it's not like kill this love for instance, right? Kill this love has this crazy entrance of of a chorus whereas with whistle. It's just Kind of vibe. It's 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 nice that the choreo complements the song itself. It's just cool. I think after this one, I definitely need to react to more dance practices. Because I feel like the only one I think I've really... Mm, have, oh, shoot. Have I watched any Blackpink dance practices? I recently watched uh, Lisa's last one that she did by herself. But I'm realizing now, I don't think I've actually watched any Blackpink dance practices. Should I watch more of those next? If y'all want me to, let me know. I'll do it. I'm down. Oh, that was so smooth. <laughs> yes. Yes. Right, okay, no, yeah, this is, I remember now, because in Atlanta, if I remember correctly, they spent the majority of the middle sort of interacting with fans and then at the very end right here they came back to the choreo I was gonna say because I remember this part of the choreo and I was like oh bro Lisa just killed that move holy crap and I'm actually I'm actually really glad that Blackpink was actually my first proper k-pop concert because everyone there was so nice I I don't know I um I don't know being being a relatively new blink it's I, I kind of felt maybe like a little bit intimidated sort of going there simply because Blackpink's fan base is super passionate and that's part of the reason why I love it so much but in the moment when we were walking up you know everybody I felt like everyone had light six I was like one of the only people that didn't have one um, but everyone was so nice the people that were sitting around us were genuinely just so excited to see the girls and I don't know it I, I'm very glad that Blackpink ended up being my first proper K-pop concert because it proved a lot of stuff wrong for me, which ended up being really cool. So, I like that a lot. Lisa's gotta chill, though. <laughs> Lisa's gotta chill. <laughs> Y'all need to chill! Anyway, um, I'll go ahead and leave it on this screen as we talk a little bit. But yeah, man, uh, like I said, in general, Whistle was definitely one of my favorite live performances from them. Um, like I said, I think Kick It definitely took the cake for me. I just... <sighs> that song live blew me away. Like, if you, if you haven't gotten the opportunity to see Blackpink live, just imagine an entire arena packed out of people. Can I kick it? <laughs> Everyone just screams. Oh my god, dude. It was so sick. Um, I wish I... I almost wish I had vlogged a little bit. I almost wish I had vlogged a little bit, but I didn't. It was kind of nice to just sort of turn the camera off and vibe out with my homies. But anyway, um, regardless, this was awesome. I loved reacting to this. If you guys want me to watch more Blackpink dance-related content, let me know. 
Um, obviously, there's not any new music videos right now for me to react to, and I want to watch Black Blackpink stuff. So, if we've got dance practices, we've got dance practices. I'll watch them, dude. But yeah, um, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like. That helps me out tremendously. And other than that, my fellow Blinks, until next time, I love you very much, and peace. Bye.